Uh, I got down to uh, Albert Dock today and I, I noticed how much pride is, is in the place. It's really beautiful and there's so much evidence of the, the manual labour that went on down there over the last couple of hundred years. And this is what we're missing in Dublin, Docklands. So I went to, to do my uh, studies on writing this song uh, to find that it's just like it's surrounded by generic office buildings and uh, very little evidence of the humanity and spirit uh, that kept the, thing, the place uh, going over the years and why, why it actually exists. So I found out that in, in between the 60s and the 80s, and I think it would have been the same here and anywhere in Europe, uh, thousands and thousands in Dublin anyway, uh, men lost their jobs due to advanced machinery and manual labour wasn't needed anymore. So I wrote my song from the point of view of a Dublin doctor who had a big family and he said, uh, come home to tell his wife that the, the, the work is gone and he can't get the word out. So he goes to the River Liffey, beautiful River Liffey that runs through Dublin and he wishes to the birds that he knows very well from working down the docks all the time. One being the heron, the fishes when the river is and the, when the water is low and the cormoran who fishes when, when the river is high and the cormorant is a fantastic bird can dive 45 meters into the deepest darkest water to get fish or what a bird will call gold and um, in mythology the cormorant if the cormorant appears to you in your darkest hours come to take your your worries away so people of liverpool this is a protest song about 50 years too late but all the same <laughs> i wrote it it's called rock the machine Thank you. Please come meet me later on. I do. I want to meet you. I'm very fond of Liverpool. Out of the cities in England, it, I am. It's very special and I have a great uh, feeling of, uh, of Irish people here. Anyway, go on. Enjoy the show. This is Rock the Machine. I wish my lord was a man. 
Oh, <laughs> 